TVN S hit drama What's Wrong with Secretary Kim has made viewers' hearts race with some memorable and romantic kiss scenes. See also, Park Seo Joon is unable to contain his fury towards Lee Tae Hwan on. What's Wrong with Secretary Kim, the popular drama has been topping the most buzzworthy dramas list for six weeks in a row, with actors Park Seo Joon and Park Ming Young also dominating the no. 1 2 spots of the most buzzworthy actors list. It also has taken first place in its time slot for ratings across all networks. Soompi. Display. News. English.300 X 250, BTF Soompi. English.300 X 250, ATF One of the most exciting aspects of the show is the chemistry between the two stars in the development of the character's romantic storyline. Check out four of the scenes that made viewers' hearts race in What's Wrong with Secretary Kim? 1. A first attempt at a kiss, with a surprise ending while the couple's first kiss, in Episode 5 didn't turn out quite as hoped, it was definitely unforgettable, with a pair working late at the office, Lee Young Joon, played by Park Seo Joon, surprised Kim Mi So, played by Park Ming Young, by confessing, Kim Mi So, I want to sway you, after the romantic line, he then touched his lips to hers. However, closing his eyes caused him to be hit by the traumatic memory of his kidnapping, and he reflexively pushed her away across the room in her office chair. The lead-up to their kiss followed by the expression on Kim Mieso's face as she was pushed away made this both a romantic and hilarious scene. It also brought the two characters into a new stage of their relationship. Solving a problem with a confession and a kiss Lee Young Joon and Kim Mieso finally confirmed their shared feelings for each other at the end of episode 8 in a touching scene. Kim Mieso confronted Lee Young Joon after a misunderstanding and told him directly that she wanted to explain everything so that they wouldn't grow apart. She shocked him by saying, I like you. I'm sorry that I'm so late to respond to all of your confessions. She also solved the problem of his trauma preventing him from kissing her when she kissed him instead. The moment was both emotional and satisfying for viewers. 3. A sweet makeup kiss in the wardrobe when Kim Mieso's sisters visited her apartment in episode 9 while Lee Young Joon was over, she insisted he hide from them in her wardrobe. After a long visit full of Lee Young Joon hearing things he shouldn't have, Kim Mieso was finally able to open up the door to let him out. He first complained about what had happened before saying he didn't want to fight anymore. He brought her down into his lap and said, You're so pretty I can't get mad at you anymore, before the couple shared a kiss in the wardrobe. While their kiss in episode 8 had been cautious and emotional, this kiss was sweeter and more romantic, signaling a change in the relationship. 4. A kiss after the truth was revealed in episode 12 of the drama, things heated up between the couple at Lee Young Joon's home. After finally revealing everything about his traumatic past to his family, he sat in thought with Kim Miso. There's nothing better than being honest, Kim Miso said to him and smiled. The mood then became romantic when Lee Young Joon asked if he could be honest with her about how he felt at that moment. They kissed before he confessed, I don't want to waste a night, and fans cheered as Lee Young Joon and Kim Miso deepened their kiss. A great touch was when Lee Young Joon untied the ribbon on Kim Mieso's blouse as the pair became closer, now free of the burden of the secret between them. Director Park Joon HWA has been praised for the way he's set up to these romantic scenes, with attention to both visual and auditory effects that ramp up the excitement and romance. For example, the lack of background music in the moments before the kiss scene in episode 12 was a perfect way to convey the tension between the couple to the viewers. It's described as allowing viewers to focus just on Lee Young Joon and Kim Mi So, which naturally made their hearts race even more. In addition, the director has been creating a charming quality unique to What's Wrong with Secretary Kim through CGI effects that are a nod to the original webtoon, as well as the perfect sound effects for each scene throughout the show. What's Wrong with Secretary Kim airs every Wednesday and Thursday on TVN at 9.30 p.m. KST. Check out the first episode of What's Wrong with Secretary Kim, if you haven't already. Vicky is also offering a 40% off sale for early access and ad-free HD viewing of What's Wrong with Secretary Kim. You can learn more here. Source 1